Police are warning you tonight about online sales after a woman found herself in a very dangerous situation last week while trying to sell her belongings. Yeah, but Lubbock police tell us there are some ways to keep yourself safe when exchanging items with strangers. Our Marty Salazar joins us from the KLBK studio. Marty, this woman was put in an awful position. It would have been a scary situation for anyone. The online exchange should have been simple, but it turned into a robbery. Luckily, the victim wasn't physically hurt, but police are still looking for the suspect. There's no 100 guarantee that it's going to be safe when you're meeting a complete stranger to buy or sell something online. Last week, a woman was held at gunpoint after posting cell phones for sale on Craigslist. The police report shows the victim and her husband went to Walmart to meet with the buyer. Her husband went shopping while she made the exchange. Police say the suspect got into her car, pointed a gun at her, and then took off with all the cell phones. <laughs> police know it's common nowadays to use apps or Facebook pages to sell things, but always take every precaution. Never meet at your home or at the other person's home. Try to meet in a public place where you know there's working security cameras and it's always better to meet during the daylight hours. Um, take a friend with you or a family member. If you can't take someone, make sure, know, make sure that someone knows where you are. Taylor mentions if the online sales seems too good to be true, it probably is and always trust your gut. Lubbock Police Department lobby is open 24-7. We have officers here at all times. Uh, and, and so if you're worried about that exchange, set the exchange up here at the police department. If someone doesn't want to meet you because it's at the police department, that's a red flag. Ms. Taylor says if something similar happens to you, be sure to call and report it to police.